name is Rajesh Pratap Singh and I'm in the business of making clothes. Basically grew up in Jaipur and cities all over Rajasthan and that's where my initial inspirations, if you want to call them inspirations, I'd call them visual references. They still play a big role in my life. That's what I always go back to. It was always uh, people and costumes from Rajasthan which made the foundation of what I do. Like most people in my generation, grew up with a lot of uh, Mario Miranda, his imagery around us, his books, his um, the work he did with Times. We grew up with that. It's something which all of us are aware of and um, I personally loved it. So like I said earlier, Mario's work is complete and uh, I didn't want to tamper with it or disturb it or we just did small we gave some small details so that it highlights itself a little bit more for example if this was a black and white it was uh, we just added some colors uh, this is after this uh, conversation we had with Habiba about how she introduced color into his artwork so that it's just something which was in the head and people in the studio and we discussed it and we just put some color gave some embroidery so that uh, it becomes 3d um, but that's all. We didn't want to do much to it because I, I think a lot of his work uh, was complete and doing too much to it would be weaning too much. It, it was not my right to do that. So I, we just did a little bit. For example, this, this was a portrait of Mario. He was traveling everywhere. So we just added a bit of embroidery with the destinations on the suitcases, the, the, the stamps. Just that added bit of things so that it becomes more 3D and interesting. So small details uh, or we just took a part of part of a larger Mario uh, painting or caricature and then focus on that. For example, uh, this was a mirror image of an al alcoholic and that's what it was and then uh, gave some flock printing. So it became more 3D. Uh, Rose who was working with us thought it was a good idea that we put the policeman's back. So it was an idea that the person's having a great time and our cop is not really uh, showing his back, has his back turned towards it. So that sense of humor was picked up from two different artworks and then uh, combined in one t-shirt. So small details like that and that's all. Not too much because his work is complete. I'm personally uh, quite excited to be tying up with Mensa on this project and I think that's the right uh, way to sell a product like this. I see a lot of future in online and it's not just about uh, accessibility, it's about a lot of other things. Uh, I buy a lot of things online and um, a lot of my customers do that too. Not everybody is really excited anymore about this whole retail uh, brick and mortar experience. So online really helps with accessibility and also with an experience which is private, it's more comfortable. As long as you're, you're kind of comfortable with the brand, when you know the brand, you know what it stands for and basics like sizing and stuff. Once that's taken care of, I think online is the best way to move forward and I think there's a lot of future to that. Look good with Mensa.com.